Hi everybody, thank you for watching. In today's story, I'm gonna show you how I got this dramatic look. In this look, I used a light brown smoky eye with a touch of purple and also red in the eyes and a super dark lipstick. This kind of vampy look is different for me, so I hope you like it. In this look, I was playing with the colors, trying to make my eyes match with my lipstick. So if you wanna learn how to get it, please keep watching. So I'm gonna start applying my primer by Lorac Pro. I know I'm using this primer every time, but I just love it. So I'm gonna apply with my clean finger all over my lid and I'm gonna blend it really well. And then I'm gonna start applying the eyeshadow. This one is Stone by Anastasia Beverly Hills. I'm gonna apply this eyeshadow all over my lid and then I will blend to my crease and outer corner. I just love the eyeshadows from Anastasia Beverly Hills. I think this work really well. And then with a clean fluffy brush, I'm gonna just blend the edges of this eyeshadow. Now, using my Naked Basics palette by Urban Decay, I'm gonna apply this light pink shade below of my brow. This will help to blend my crease color and also I'm gonna apply the shade in my tear duct area. With my black gel eyeliner by Sigma, I'm gonna line my eyes. There's no need to be perfect because we will blend this eyeliner. The name of the color of this eyeliner is Wicked. So after this, I'm gonna just apply a matte black eyeshadow on top of this eyeliner to blend. And this will create a beautiful smoke effect. So the black eyeshadow that I'm gonna apply is the color Crave. I'm gonna apply this eyeshadow with a small brush on top of the eyeliner. Already starting to create the smoke effect. Again, with the Naked Basics palette, I'm gonna apply the color Faint to create more dimension in my crease with a small pencil brush. Just to remember, all the brushes that I'm using in this look are from Sigma Beauty and most of them you can find in the Starbucksa kit. And then I'm gonna change the brush for the same fluffy brush that I blend my crease before and then I'm gonna blend it again without any product. Now I'm gonna start my lower lash line with the color Crave with a really small angled brush for eyeliner. I'm gonna apply this color so close to my lash line. Now to make the shadows bright, in my lower lash line, I'm gonna apply a shadow base. This is a shimmery eyeshadow base by NYX. I'm using the color Cottage Cheese. I'm gonna apply this with an angled brush. I'm gonna apply the color Victorious in my lower lash line. This is a beautiful purple shade by Art Stuff Makeup and this will give more definition in the makeup. Thank you. 
Now to create a fun shade, I'm gonna mix the color brazing also by Art Stuff Makeup with a small fluffy brush. And after this, I'm gonna apply my favorite mascara, the Rocket Volume by Maybelline, and my fake lashes by Velour Lashes. To finish my face, I'm gonna apply this beautiful blush by MAC in the color Breed of Plum. And then I'm gonna line my lips with this lip liner by NYX. This lip liner is in the color Deep Purple. I'm gonna line my lips creating more definition. And then with a really small brush I'm gonna blend creating an ombre effect. And now I'm gonna apply this awesome liquid lipstick by Anastasia Beverly Hills. This awesome lipstick is in the color Sad Girl. This liquid lipstick dries matte and what I have to say is that I absolutely love this shade. And also the formula is not so dry like the other liquid lipsticks. So this one is much better to apply. So this is the final result, I really hope you enjoyed this tutorial, thank you so much for watching, I had a lot of fun creating this look for you, and I see you in the next time.